A 7 News alert. Deputies in Cherokee County are investigating after they say a man shot his neighbor while he was target having target practice in his backyard. 7 News' Chloe Salsamita spoke with the victim's family. Investigators tell me Keisha Tate was shot and killed Saturday when a bullet came through her window while she was making dinner for her children. Cherokee County deputies were called to a home on Songbird Lane just after 6.30 Saturday night. That's where they say they found 42-year-old Keisha Tate. According to the coroner's office, she was struck and killed by a stray bullet when she was standing in her home. This is something you can't believe, you know. It's I mean, you in your home, you cooking dinner for your kids and, you know, you expect to sit down and eat with them and now something happening. One of Tate's family members tells 7 News her children were in the home when their mother was shot. And now the kids are crying for their mother, you know what I'm saying, they want their mama, but they, they're not going to help us see their mama again. According to investigators, Tate's neighbor, 30-year-old Nicholas Lucas, was shooting a gun in his backyard while he was target practicing. They believe one of those bullets killed Tate. Why would something happen to her this way? Lucas has been arrested and charged with involuntary manslaughter and shooting under the influence. Tate's family member tells me she had been concerned about her neighbor firing a gun in his yard for months. In a statement, Sheriff Steve Mueller says, quote, This is a senseless death that could have been avoided had the gun owner been responsible or chosen a safer place to target practice. The Sheriff's Office says more charges could be filed. In Cherokee County, Chloe Salsameda, 7 News. An autopsy for Tate is scheduled for today.